All right, what I'm showing in the beginning is what you'll need. You'll need two, two, two different programs to have this all in your browser before you go any further because you want to make sure you don't get any kind of viruses and whatnot or redirects. Well, what I'm showing now is Solar Movie. There's different versions of Solar Movie. There's probably like five or six different versions of it. There's also a fake version out there, but be careful. That's why you need the two programs that I showed in the beginning for these types of movie websites so you can browse between movies and TV shows for all of them. And there's like five, between five and ten different Putlocker websites that you can view. I'm just quickly taking you in between three or four of them right now that are linked in my browser. Sometimes some of them have like two or three links, some of them have like 20 links to watch. You just have to click and play, and then uh, sometimes you got to double click the play button or wait for the media to load maybe a few minutes before playing it again. It's a little tricky, but one of these sites will work best for you to find any kind of movie, any TV show you want to catch up on, or old TV show. These sites will have them for you. They're easy to find. I watch different versions of Star Trek. For your browser. Now you'll go onto the screen, as you can see, the website I'm using, which will pop up. You, you had to create an account. You used to be able to watch most of the links there for free without having to sign in, but I just create an account. It's quick and easy, and it takes literally a second once you create your account. You can just log right in. Once you've logged in, you can just type in whatever type of program you want to watch. I'm going to type in Lucifer. And then once you get to that page and you click on the show, sometimes when you click on the links, you'll have to double click. Once you get to the video, there'll be another button below it. And then you click on that button and it will take you to a new page with the video and then you can start playing the video. I'd be careful with some of the links because some of the links have redirects. But other than that, as long as you have the add-ons that I listed in the beginning added, you should be fine.